Welcome back. My name's Chris. And I'm Misty. This is Storm Games. Welcome back to Storm Games. Um, it's been a while since we've done unboxing or share, share time. time. It's Monday. Um, so this week we have some stuff from the Comic Con sales. Um, None of this is Comic Con exclusives. We're, we're going to have a whole other two videos oh, for that. I didn't know. Okay. Yeah. This is just other stuff that we picked up okay. during that period. <laughs> Let's start with the cutest. Our little mopes. This is the Groot. Iron Man. Yeah. Of course, Iron Man. Of course, Iron Man. Of course, Iron Man. I wanted the rocket too, but I didn't want to get him. The rocket one's really cute. They are how much? Like ten, eleven dollars. Ten fifty. Ten fifty at um, Hot Topic. I think they were cheaper at Toys R Us though. They were. They were like. But then again, everything's cheaper when you're not buying at a Hot Topic. They're like <laughs> between eight and nine dollars. Yeah. But we use Hot Topic cash. They only mm. had Iron Man, Captain America, and Hulk. Most of this was bought with Hot Topic cash yeah. or Barnes and Noble coupons, that kind of stuff. Yeah. So love Barnes and Noble. Um, something I got, else I got at Hot Topic is it's an Infinity scarf. Harley, well, her design. Harley Quinn. He loves it. I love Speaking it. Speaking of Harley Quinn, look at the door. I'm so excited about that. It's so cute. We're now collecting all the dorbs. Um, just, we got Groot and now Harley. I've considered collecting the, uh... The Batman and... No, the, uh... Guardians ones. But, I don't know. We're looking for the Joker. Have I do Harley need Joker. Joker. Joker's the only other one I really need. <clears throat> to go with my Joker collection. Yep. My ever-growing Joker collection. And no Harley. And... <laughs> Picked up a Harley Scaler, like yeah. a Scaler. That's what your third Scaler. Yeah, my first was Iron Man, and then I got a Joker one, don't I? She looks very cray cray on that. Is my other one Joker or Batman? I don't, I don't know. That's on your speakers over there. No, that's the Iron Man one. Oh, I, I think the other know. one's Joker. No, yeah, it's Joker. Either okay. But that one's a bigger one. That one's not no. the size. It's the same size. Same size. Okay, different box. <laughs> it's my joke. He loves it. I do I haven't figured out a way to hang him yet. We'll find. So I get something. some wire that they could hang on, but. Continue with the Batman. Earth, Earth two, 2 Batman. Batman found it at Hot Topic. I've only seen these online. It's the first one. I've seen it when we first started collecting pops. Yeah. Hot Topic had a lot of these, and I didn't. I what? Wasn't really into collecting it's the Batman pops then. Um, since then, I've decided um, I'm only collecting the Batman pops, um, other than Harley and Jokers. Yeah. Um, I've stopped collecting the other ones, like the Robins and the Nightwings and the you know all the other ones, with the exception of the Dark Knight or the Arkham, the Arkham video game series. Because I've got the first wave, and I'm getting the second wave as soon as it comes in. I've got it pre-ordered at, um, actually it's pre-ordered and already paid for at GameStop, so. I really want the, for, as far as the mopes, I really want the Harley and Joker. They just look so cute. Um, but they're not yeah, out no. anywhere yet. DC and ones aren't out yet. Also with Deadpool, there is a Deadpool one coming out. So... During, uh, this guy came out during the, uh, Comic-Con period. Mm -hmm. Um, this is, uh, Vault, the Glow-in-the-Dark Vault Boy from Hot Topic. Obviously from Fallout. I wasn't going to get him, but there again I spent many of our playing quite a few of the <laughs> the Fallout games. He looks really cool. Um, I've played all the Fallout games, but I've spent a lot of time on Fallout 3 and New Vegas. 
Yeah, it's really so cool it, in the dark. It Even in a black light. I at least get one yeah. pop. Um, I, I guess I can start with the, some Ant Man. Yeah, we got some Ant Man. We pops. have the yellow jacket, which he looks pretty cool. This is the regular well, yellow I'm real jacket. I'm really excited about the yellow jacket ones. Even though I haven't seen the movie yet. I mean, yeah, I know. It comes out this weekend. I know this isn't the same yellow jacket that's traditionally in the comics. This um, is. But. Yeah. The heads are really heavy. Oh, well, Marvel. Um. I wish Marvel would pick and choose which ones get bubbles, which ones don't. Oh, Marvel get bubbles. The noise. That's the rule. This is the normal, um, Ant Man. Regular Ant Man. Regular yeah. Ant Man. That's the regular yellow jacket. This is the glow in the dark. The this Amazon is the Amazon, yeah. Amazon exclusive. Glow in the dark. Glow in the dark. It looks pretty cool. And that's thanks to Scott Earl. Yeah, Pulver, all of our Ant Man ones Funko. we got from Scott. At only Funko. He has he, a whole bunch more. He pre-ordered those over there and uh, to make sure that I got them. And he texted me. He's like, "They're in." I'm like, "Yay!" Yeah. I don't even know if the Amazon ones are still selling. They, they might be sold out of those. He, I'm sure he could get but, get some. I did see it when I pre-ordered the the um, Comic Con Olaf. I'm so excited about this one. The yellow dress um, area with legs and the blue dress. The blue dress, sorry. I'm She's got her aerials and bells mixed yeah, up. Yeah, she has the pretty bow. And feet. She's got feet. Not flipper. Feet. Um, to kind of top off, to, I don't know if it's, I got every one for the Frozen set so far. There is some Olaf's I'm missing, some Glow in the Dark and some variants. Sparkly and uh, Olaf. Look at the back of the box there. I'll tell you which um, one's on there. Well, this is the second wave. It's, yeah. Well, we don't still don't know about Marshmallow Six Inch, so people were thinking maybe that would have came out during Comic Con, but it hasn't. It's just it's Six Inch stamp, Marshmallow it's a by solo itself. Stamp. Yeah, he's got a different pose than um, the. Um, uh, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. Now, got it. Coronation. I don't have the regular coronation. Also, I have the one with the scepter and orb from Hot, Hot Topic. Topic exclusive, yeah. I got coronation on a summer off, upside down a off. Yeah. No, but it's from the another one. I'm missing a couple other offs. I know there was an Entertainment Earth. I think he's a glow in the dark. I can't remember. But it's young Anna and young Elsa. So cute. I got, I got this with a uh, Barnes and Noble discount. Mm -hmm. My Darth Vader fabrication. He's cool. I've been needing one of these since I've seen that come out. He won't be coming out of his box though. Because I like him in the box. He's like a combination of corduroy and leather though. It's yeah. weird. His outfit is. Mostly leather, but he's got some corduroy parts on him. It's kind of cool. Say my name. Eisenberg. God damn right. I've been eyeballing this series of characters um, for a while, and I've only seen the um, Walter White, Walter and Jesse in their lab coats. Yeah. Um, and then Gus. And there was actually a misprint, I'm assuming, because on the back of the Walter White in the lab coat, it mm -hmm. actually has the Heisenberg card to it. Right. Um, so I'd get I'd get all excited when I seen the Heisenberg card and flip it over, and it was Aww. the it was the Walter White with the lab coat. <laughs> yeah. Which it didn't make sense because the other Walter White actually has a Walter White card. That matches, and all the others have the cards that match the yeah. character in the box. Um, I think it was just an error at the. Fact I don't know if it was an error, or they were saving money or what, but <laughs> it's Mezco toys. Um, again, I went, we went to Barnes and Noble and we got the fabrication, and I seen the the card from the back, and I was, you know, I was like, ah, whatever. It's probably the stupid. Yeah. 
lab coat when and I flipped it over and sure enough it was Heisenberg this time. He's so like, we have to get this. I have to get it. It was the first time I had seen the Heisenberg and I think it was the only one they had there. Mm -hmm. um, and all you inbox in package collectors are going to kick my butt, but I always take my figures out of the cases. He's got the bag of money. He's got a little bag of crystal meth too. Oh, does he? I just noticed that. Oh, I did too. Oh, his hat comes off. Take us. He's got a little plastic thing on us. He's pretty solid. Pretty well, Almost lost his meth. Party fail. No, no, look. Oh, what? Well, his move. arms don't move. No. Everything, even the strap on the bag, is pretty. Holding his meth. Mm. Don't it's worry, meth. it's not real meth. It's not real meth. <laughs> like I'd know what meth smells like. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of creepy. Yeah, old face mask to protect his face. But... Kind of cool. I kind of wish the duff no. thing could go over his shoulder, but that's cool though. I'll go up with the other. A huge Breaking Bad fan, and yeah. this was um, a must-have when I see him. I really want the. Uh, I think he's 11 inches. It's like this tall. I see him there, but he's he's a little pricey. Yeah. So. Pre-order from GameStop came in. I've got I'm the white say something first about this. Sure. We had it on pre-order. I've seen yeah. other people posting about that, you know, they picked theirs up, that their order was in, and they're at the store. We've stopped at ours and asked the guy, he's like, I'm like, we haven't got it, our car yet. He's like, well, let me look it up. Oh, it says it's in store. So we started looking around at where the pops are. There was are. one on the shelf. Yeah. They didn't. They didn't hold one back for me. No. They stuck them all on the shelf. Um, I'm just assuming that they got one or two in and put them on the shelf. So if you have and one, didn't look at their pre-orders. Yeah. So if you pre-ordered one at your local GameStop, I suggest you go look at your go local GameStop store uh, shelves. See if it's um, available. And see if it's there because this guy was sitting on the shelf and he was the only one on the shelf. I like it. And I, already, I had him pre-ordered and paid for, so there was no reason why they didn't, when they pulled him out of the box, yeah. put him behind the counter. Well, the same with the TARDIS. We pre-ordered one at Hot Topic. It was supposed to be in the beginning of July. It's now middle of July. Still nothing, so I used Hot Topic cash and got it cheaper. The door opened. It's TARDIS. great. He does his like a lot of Um, But I didn't expect it to be hollow at the bottom. Well, it's got a... Oh, you mean... It's no, yeah. That, it's not. This should be considered a pop ride. Well, or a pop dwelling. <laughs> dwelling. <laughs> it's bigger on the inside. I mean, because the doctors practically live in this thing, right? Because <laughs> it's bigger on the inside. It's much bigger on the inside. That's it. That's everything, right? Everything on your side? Oh, no, you got one he more went, thing over he there. He went for a ride. Who'd you put the TARDIS? <laughs> I'm gone. Who knows where in time that thing's going to end up. So, I still like collecting minions and minis, and this is not a normal mini, but it's Princess Elsa, or, shoot, Agnes. Agnes. I'm sorry, I'm tired. So look she'll at all the tie, she'll, uh, when I when I When we seen her, I said, I, you I have to get her. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of these I've seen on on uh, Amazon um, as a group, and I really wanted to get it, but I'm like, oh, I don't know. There's, when the we seen one. her, I said, you have to get it, because it'll have to tide you over until we find the Agnes Mini. Yeah. Uh, we've got the other two sisters, we don't have Agnes. And this, <laughs> and this was minis, so. at Agnes's birthday party in Despicable Me, too. Yeah. You need to have... Um, Rate her fluffy. Yeah. It's so fluffy, I'm going to so die. It's so fluffy, I'm going to die. She's adorable. So that was share time for this week. Uh, it was kind of big. And we still got another video coming up for you. 
um, with our first wave of um, SDCC pickups, and I got some mm -hmm. good ones. Some good ones. Um, so yeah, we'll have that coming up for you. So stay tuned for that. And thanks for watching, guys. Let if us know you, what you think. I'm sorry. Go ahead. If you've picked up anything recently, let us know. Um, still love always pictures people will post of how they display their pops. If you're an inbox collector or you're out of box collector, there's a big controversy on that. Some pops we leave in boxes, others we take out. <laughs> the ones I tend to leave in the box are the ones that don't stand very well on my yeah. own. Other than that, I like to get them out and display them. Yep. So thanks for watching, guys, and let us know what you think in the comments below. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.